We're learning new details about an investigation which led to raids at two massage parlors in Bardstown. Three people are now facing human trafficking charges. WLKY Shaquille Lord spoke with investigators who believe there are possibly more victims. After a year-long investigation, Bardstown police investigators announced they arrested three people in connection to human trafficking. A year's worth of police work led to a bust at two massage parlors in Bardstown. Three people were arrested and charged with human trafficking and permitting prostitution. Detective Eric Williamson is with the Bardstown Police Department. During the course of our investigation, we were able to you know, make traffic stops and do quite a bit of surveillance, which led to eventually executing six different search warrants, two of those being at the actual spa locations. Miyako Spa on North 3rd Street and Sunrise Massage and Body Work on Morn Avenue is where investigators say they found at least two victims, but they believe there are likely more. You know, they would have to do this by force, fraud, and coercion. You know, they live in deplorable conditions. You know, on one of the, one of the locations, they were sleeping on the floor in the kitchen, cooking food off a hot plate. Williamson says a tip prompted the investigation. He credits Attorney General Daniel Cameron's office for helping. Back in January, Cameron announced his office was expanding a program to target these types of businesses. At least eight suspected trafficking businesses have been shut down since the HOPE initiative started last fall. This spa here in Barstown is connected to other spas, and then the owners have had other spa business before in other states. So yes, there is a huge network, you know, that's the thing. It's not just something small local that happens. It's a huge, huge problem through the state of Kentucky and a huge problem through the country. Several people told WLKY off camera that they're not surprised by these charges. Williamson says he hopes these arrests encourages people in the area to speak up. This is a, a community problem that we need community input. If somebody in the community um, has input or information regarding this investigation or other investigations, please call us and let us know. In Bardstown, I'm Shaquille Lord, WLKY News.